Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of a Let's Play A Hat In Time Blind. This is Soup, as per always. And last time we finished Battle With The Beds. And this time, I think we're going to do a little bit of cleanup. Because we have all of these uh, blue time rifts. To look for and I think I know where these are so let's go to the final act and let's just see what we can find out then it gives me an excuse to see this uh, splash green again it's just so cute Here we go, loading in. And as as we always seem to be doing anymore when we come here, we're just going to ignore the uh um the golden uh vault. And instead, we're going to go on a little treasure hunt. Waiting for my game to catch up with me. And I think I know... I think I have a good idea of where these are. I just need to locate them specifically. The tutorial mafia. So Aha, I knew I knew I'd find one of them. Let's do the time warp again. Time Rift. Bizarre. Are we underwater? I guess we are. Checkpoint. I'm assuming that would be exceptionally difficult without the uh, time. Huh. Whoa. That was cool. Oh, cookies! Oh crap. Uh, 
Oh, that's not good. Controller is acting up on me, and I'm not a fan of that. Especially not that button. I use that button a lot. It's the uh, dive button. I think they're just cookies just fall out of the out of space time. I mean, at least it's not the hat use button, but still. New colors? Yeah, sure, why not? And let's equip them. Let's see what I look like uh, uh, blue and yellow. I actually kind of like that. That's blueberry pie, cookie dough, freedom, margin of the night. I think I still like this one the best. What's... I forgot what hat girl looked like default. I forgot she's a brunette. <laughs> I actually kind of like this one. I think this is the one we used a lot, but... That's not good. Let me see if I can fix this super quick. Hopefully through the power of editing this won't take too long. Okay. I'll just have to That's gonna be a bother. I have to live with it. Until I can get a until I can break this thing apart again and fix it. But anyway, let's go to the next one. Okay. I think I know where that is too. Let's see if I'm right. We should be fairly close to it actually. Aha, there it is. I was right. And Hat Girl is like looking out somewhere. Time Rift the Sewers. Oh no. Oh, this is going to take some editing. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. 
I completely not like didn't get that timing down. Can I just say I really do like these environments? Checkpoint. Let's see how this... Alright, that was easy. And I didn't need to use this, the... That button. Mafia Town all clear. Achievo unlocked. You know what, let's reroll. I'm not those colors don't look all that great. Well, it looks like uh minty fresh. Looks like we don't really have too much of a choice in the matter. Looks like we're going with some um, new colors. Yay. Yay, yay. What do we look like now? Ooh. I actually kind of like... I actually kind of like it. Though, I don't... It doesn't really scream mint to me. It screams more mustard. But whatever. What do I... What the hell do I know? Now... Since we got a little bit of t since we still have some time, okay. Okay, so these will actually have to go to specific, uh, Events. This one, I'm pretty sure, will be Murder of the in the Owl Express. I don't know how they got mint from that. I know it's supposed to be green and then just kind of the color palette. I think, aha, hello, we didn't even have to go through too much of this mission, which this mission takes all forever, Time Rift, the Owl Express, all right. Okay, I see what I have to do here. And into the wild blue yonder. Let's try that again with less failure. Having the uh, the dive button wouldn't have helped me there. Having the dive button would have helped me there though, but whatever. Oh cool, this is not uh, rotating anymore. Asshole. Wow. The button's working. It's on a trigger. Actually, can I? Alright, apparently I can't fix that, so... Woo. 
This is actually kind of difficult. Alright, checkpoint. The problem is I'm not getting hurt, so if I... Oh, why'd you turn around like that? This is, I love these levels. They're just really cool. And the atmosphere is just really calm and serene. And we get, you know what? Nah, let's re-roll. Nah, let's re, damn it. I'm not happy. Oh. Looks like we've unlocked something. But we're already here. And this is in the parade. The big parade. Um, okay. I think I know where that is. This is gonna be a hard level without the uh, without the de without the dive. Did the, did the gravity get turned down like a lot? Because I'm floating a lot more than I'm like used to. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I love her just dead eyed look and the moon. Oh no. We got the. Yup. They brought that mechanic here. Interesting. I. I thanks, I hate it. Checkpoint. This is actually incredibly challenging because I so so I can at least like talk about it and not just be like wow wow that was epic bullshit 
Oh. I didn't know checkpoints uh, survive through that. Well, I guess that's what a checkpoint is, dumbass. But uh, regardless, so I play this with a uh, with a PS4 controller. Wow. I don't know if this is better or worse. But, anyway, back to what I was saying. I play this with a PS4 controller. Seriously? Seriously? Anyway. And and so the dive button is the uh, right trigger. And normally that's actually really nice because it's a uh, nice. Oh God, bless it. You know what? I'm gonna take that as a blessing and just run with it. I should have just jumped off the edge a while ago. But my stubbornness didn't let me. Uh, wow. But normally that's fine because the right trigger is really nice. Yes, 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 yes. Let just respawn me. Maybe I shouldn't have done this because this is really obnoxious. God damn it. The worst part is I have to take two hits if I f land on the previous section. But I normally play. I normally, it works just fine. But for some reason, it is sticking. Like the it's not falling back into a neutral position. Was that so hard? Apparently it was. So to get it to go back to a neutral position, I have to actually push it forward. Oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. And now I get it first try. God damn. But, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, and so now if I want to do the dive move, which has now become such a staple of my move set with Hat Girl, I have to not only um, just push the button in, and then she will automatically just get out of it as soon as it's done. Come on! <laughs>
uh, now I have to push it forward, which sounds like a not a big deal, but oh, come on. When you're not thinking about it and it's not a part of your just muscle memory, it can be a bit of a pain. Just fall off, fall off. No! Fall off! God damn. Please tell me you're a checkpoint. Nope, you're the end. Oh, bow the birds all clear. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. I'll take that. And I'll equip. I didn't see what the name of that, of the color was, but. So you see now that she's just like staying here and pouting. And now I can't get her to dive again until I push it back. Ugh. I love the PS4 controller. The PlayStation controllers has always, has always been my favorite. They're just pretty, in my opinion, they're just per generally perfect. But the PS4 has a couple things I don't like about it. Namely the charging port. The charging port is awful. But anyway... I'm going to edit here because I need to get this video uh, edited and uploaded because I'm actually recording this the night before it goes out because reasons. And I also need to break this controller apart and uh, figure out what's going on with it and fix it because that's not ha that's not going to that's not going to that's not going to fly guy. But anyway, those were my problems. I want to thank you all for watching, uh, and until next time, when I think we're gonna clear out a couple extra, a couple other areas of their um, additional uh, time rifts. And if I, I, I don't do a ton. I'm not doing a ton, any nearly any research on this game. But now that I've kind of beaten the majority of it, I'm kind of letting myself see more, look at more stuff about it. And I think there are 40 timepieces in the main game. And I think I'm going to at least get them all and then, then we'll see what happens from there. But until then, guys, goodbye.